Hello, I'm Dominic, and I'm going to show you how you do question one of Max Viva Voce. So let's wait. Okay. So first, we want to do the part one. So first, you read the questions. The figure shows the length of three sides of a rectangle AB equals to two x plus three cm CD. Equals to three x minus seven cm, and AD equals to four x minus thirty cm. So, part one of the question is find the numerical value of x. So when we see at this diagram, we look at this diagram, we know that AB is the same as DC because they are a rectangle. So. 2x plus 3 equals to 3x minus 7 because they are of the same length. So I decided to put it down 2x plus 3 equals to 3x minus 7. And then I want to find out what is x. So I bring all the known to one side and all the unknown to the other side. So for for his for this, I bring the negative 7 to another side, so it becomes positive 7. And I bring the positive 2x to another side, then it becomes negative 2x. So positive 7 plus 3 is equals to 10. And 3x minus 2x equals to x. And now you get the answer, 10 equals to x. So 10 is the answer for the first part. Now we go on to the second part. The second part is question uh, part 2. So they say find the numerical area of the rectangle in cm squared. So I want to find the numerical area of the rectangle in cm squared. So I'll take 3x minus 7 and I times it with 4x minus 30. And then I will take, I will substitute the 3x with 10 because I want to find a numerical value. So x equals to 10 and 3x equals to 30. So it's like 10 times 3 equals to 30. And 10 times 4 equals to 40. So it's 30 minus 7 times 40 minus 30. So it's equals to twenty three times ten, which is equals which is also equals to two hundred and thirty cm squared. So now I get the area, the numerical area of the rectangle in cm squared, which is two hundred and thirty cm squared. Okay, now we finish part three. So part three says. Convert the numerical area of the rectangle to meter squared. So since we know that, we already know that the answer is in cm squared. We just have to do one more step to make it to meter squared. So first, I we we know that two hundred and thirty cm squared is equals to twenty three cm times ten cm, which is quite straightforward. So now we change it to we change the units to meter, so 1 meter is 100 cm, so 1 cm is 0 0.01 meters. So 23 cm is equals to 0 0.23 meters, and 10 cm is 0 0.1 meters. So 0 0.23 meters times 0 0.1 meters is equals to 0 0.023 meters squared. So the answer for part 3 is 0 0.023 meters squared. Thank you.